you know, I was hoping this week you could take over some of the lines. Maybe you could read a little bit of the narration. What do you think? No? We can talk about that. Are you ready for some good news? First up, for the first time ever, scientists have successfully transmitted entangled particles from the Earth to space. Quantum entanglement is the strange phenomenon whereby particles interact in such a way that their quantum states can no longer be described individually, but only as a group, even if the particles are subsequently separated by a great distance. Entangled particles offer the possibility of instantaneous communication because to know the state of one particle in an entangled group is to know the state of all the particles in that group. Scientists in China working with the Quantum Experiments at Space Scale, or QUES program, have successfully transmitted entangled photons from Earth to a suborbital satellite a special polarized laser beam capable of carrying particles from Earth to space and from space to Earth simultaneously was used to carry the photons through the atmosphere. The satellite was able to transmit entangled photons between three different receiving stations located throughout China, separated from each other by as much as 1,200 kilometers. A network of quantum communication satellites would be vastly faster and more efficient than current systems, but that's still quite a way in the future. Much sooner than that, the ability to successfully send and receive entangled particles between Earth and satellites could enable scientists to study the still mysterious field of quantum mechanics in ways that were not possible before. The results of the Chinese Quest study are published in the journal Science. How do you like them apples? Well, you don't like apples, do you? How do you like them live birds? It's gross anyway. Next up, scientists at Stanford University have achieved a breakthrough that could lead to the highways of the future being filled with electric cars. The Stanford scientists have developed a way to wirelessly transmit electricity to moving objects. Imagine technology enabling electric cars to be charged while they're driving down the road, their range increased indefinitely. Imagine cell phones able to recharge while they're in your pocket. Imagine electronic medical implants that recharge themselves with no intervention required from doctors or patients. The possibilities are virtually limitless. The system uses magnetic resonance coupling to transmit electricity wirelessly. The prototype is only capable of transmitting at a distance of about three feet, so don't look for those wireless electric cars to hit the market anytime soon. Then again, that prototype was built with mostly off-the-shelf components. The Stanford scientists expect that a custom-built system will have much greater potential. The results of their research are published in the journal Nature. Finally, that same tantalizingly attainable future with its quantum communications networks and self-charging wireless electric cars could have another handy feature, paint that generates clean energy. Researchers at Australia's RMIT University have developed a type of paint that can harvest hydrogen from water vapor. The paint contains a mixture of a compound called synthetic molybdenum sulfide and titanium oxide, which is already commonly used to make paint white. That combination of ingredients allows the paint to absorb both sunlight and water vapor and to split the water vapor into its basic elements of hydrogen and oxygen. The hydrogen can then be harvested and used in fuel cells, and because the paint absorbs water vapor from the surrounding air, it wouldn't need to be supplied with water in order to generate the hydrogen. Even relatively dry areas could benefit from the paint's ability to draw hydrogen out of, essentially, thin air. The paper on this water-splitting, hydrogen-harvesting paint is published in the journal ACS Nano. I mean, personally, I think that's some very cool news. I think it's worthy of a little bit more excitement than what you're showing me right now, don't you think? Are you actually asleep? 
Anyway, entangled particles are transmitted from Earth to space for the first time. New technology could lead to wireless charging of moving electric cars. And a new kind of paint could someday harvest clean fuel from surrounding water vapor. That's the good news. Shh, heaven forbid we disturb the cat. Hey folks, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed this one. If you did, please like, share, and subscribe. And also please consider helping me to make more videos like this one by supporting this channel through Patreon. You can go to patreon.com slash steveshives to become a patron. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time. I know what you're thinking. Why don't I shoot these videos when you're awake and moving around instead of when you're asleep? Well, the answer to that is I don't feel like shooting videos at 3 a.m.